hello everyone how to simplify this algebraic expression if we have 4 to the power of 3 to the power of 2 to the power of 1 minus 1234 so we write this algebraic expression into the uh, simplified form but here do you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem so it means that we will show all of the working on this paper so here uh, the very first thing we are going to do is here first you see that this is uh, 2 to the power of 1 and we very well know about that 2 to the power of 1 means that it is equals to 2 and similarly in the same pattern uh, you see here we have this is uh, 3 to the power of 2 and now we write it as after applying 2 to the power of 1 equals 2 this will be written as 4 to the power of 3 to the power of 2 minus this is 1234 and now you see here we get a 3 square and you know that this 3 square is equals to 9 and we will replace this 3 square is equals to 9 so after replacing this value it will be written as 4 to the power of 9 minus 1234 so now in the next step uh, here we need to break this uh, uh, to we break this base 4 and we uh, we know that uh, 4 is equals to 2 square so we write here our base as in this form so this is a uh, 2 square and its whole power is 9 minus this is 1234 so further in the next step uh, you see here uh, we have exponent to the exponent and here we can apply this nice exponent law you know that if we have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by n and now here further in the next step uh, when we multiply these two exponents then it will be written as 2 to the power of 2 times of 9 becomes here 18 minus this is uh, 1234 and now so here uh, in order to move further we need to solve this problem so uh, here first we break this value as this is 2 to the power of 18 we write it as 2 to the power of 8 plus 10 minus this is 1234 so here we use this exponent law you know about that if we have a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n according to this exponent law we break this exponent and it will be written as 2 to the power of 8 multiplied by 2 to the power of 10 minus 1234 so further in the next step we need to find the value of 2 to the power of 8 and 2 to the power of 10 and it is very simple to find the value of 2 to the power of 10 it is equals to 1024 and we know that 2 to the power of 8 is equals to 256 so this is 256 so now we replace these two values here and now uh, after replacing these values we will be written as 256 multiplied by 1200 1024 minus this is 1234 so here further in the next step uh, we need to multiply first these two values and then we can subtract it with this value uh, so here first we break this value as and we write this term as it is it is 1024 into we write this value as and we break this 256 as this is 200 plus 50 and plus 6 and at the last we subtract it with 1234 and now here further in the next step we multiply these uh, this value in these three terms and now here first we multiply this term with this it will be written as 1024 multiplied by 200 plus 
1024 multiplied by 50 plus 1024 multiplied by 6 and it is subtracted with 1234 and now first we multiply these two terms and after multiplication of terms we get a, these are two zeros we can just write these two zeros here and we multiply two with each of these numbers and you see here two fours are eight two twos are four and two zeros are zero and two ones are two and plus we multiply this these two numbers with here so zero times of this number equals to zero five times of this number is equals to five fours are twenty we write 0 and carry 2, 5 2 is a 10, 10 plus 2 becomes 12, we write 2 and carry 1, 5 zeros are 0, 0 plus 1 is 1 and 5 ones are 5. And in the same pattern we multiply 6 with this number and you see here, 6 4 is a 24, we write here 4 and carry 2, 6 2 is a 12, 12 plus 2 becomes 14. We write 4 and carry 1, 6 0 is a 0, 0 plus 1 is 1 and 6 1 is a 6. And at the last we subtract this value with 1234. So here uh, first we need to subtract these two values, add these two values and subtract these two values. Okay. So when we add these two values it will be written as 0 plus 0 becomes 0 this 0 plus 0 is also becomes 0 8 plus 2 becomes 10 we write 0 and carry 1 4 plus 1 is 5 5 plus 1 becomes 6 and 0 plus 5 becomes here 5 and at the last we will get here 2 only and now here in the next step we subtract these two values and we will get here 4 minus 4 becomes 0 4 minus 3 becomes 1 and this one is not subtracted here too so we carry 1 from here and it will become 11 and here we get 5 and 11 minus 2 becomes here 9 and here we get 5 minus 1 becomes here 4. So in the final step we add these two values and we will get here our final destination. So we have this is 0 plus 0 becomes 0, 0 plus 1 becomes here 1 this 0 plus 9 becomes 9 this 6 plus 4 becomes 10 we write 0 and carry 1 and we have 5 plus 1 is 6 and at the last we will get here 2 only so this is the our final simplified form of the given question and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos